of a black woman. What do you think you're achieving by all this nonsense, eh? You're not fooling anyone, by it. You're certainly not fooling me. And what's more, you know you're not. So why bother to keep on with it? What? You know what well enough. This Relatively Speaking was written in 1965 by Alan Akeborn. And he was asked to write it by Stephen Joseph for the theatre up in Scarborough in, um, in an attempt to cheer up dreary holiday makers whose summer holidays had been ruined by rain. So it was really important that he wrote something that appealed to a broad um, section of the population and would cheer them up. I really think you ought to go and do some digging and work a little of it off, whatever it is. No, I'll do some hoeing. I don't feel in the least like digging this morning. From the way you do it, I can't see there's much difference. So he wrote, relatively speaking, which is a beautiful comedy set in an idyllic summer, the kind of summer that just doesn't exist in the UK. So it's, it's a real treat to inhabit that world. Um, and it turned out to be his first big success. It was the first play of Eight Bournes to transfer to the West End, and the critics absolutely adored it. She painted a fantastic picture of you. You don't know. She said that... When an extra person turned up for lunch, you went into a panic, that sort of thing. She did? Yes. This is Ginny, is it? Yes. She obviously doesn't know you, does she? <laughs> no, not at all. They have picked up on its gossamer-like quality. It is fantastical and unbelievable, but just by the skin of his teeth, this absurd plotting gets away with itself. Looking for the hole! Well, you won't be in there, will it? Hardly likely, I should think! I think it is as true and marvellous as it was 30 years ago. Alan Akebourne's great strength is to write about quite bleak and difficult um, emotional territory, but with a lightness of touch and a generosity and a sympathy and most of all just comic brilliance and I think that's really eternal territory This really. is the Williams, isn't it? Yes? Lower pen, box, 